Gripping on the comma, what a 211 in my mind Persuaded by the devil, gripping on my black plastic now Search if I will look dead, I can hit with murder in my soul Swinging bending corners in the 67 L coat one Piece's new era consists of some really powerful characters like Kaido, Shanks and Big Mom, etc. These characters are the first names on any list when we're talking about the strongest characters. However, they weren't always so strong. They had to climb up slowly until they reached the peak of their powers. Before these characters came to power, there were other characters who were at the higher echelons. They were characters from the old era, there are still many characters about we know very little and we can expect more information on the older characters in the upcoming time. Charlotte Linlin is the captain of the Big Mom Pirates. Big Mom is one of the four Yonku and she has an enormous bounty of 4,388,000,000 berries. Big Mom possesses the Soru Soru Nomi that allows her to take the souls of her opponents. She has all three types of hockey. Before becoming a Yonku, Big Mom was a member of Rock's Pirates. The crew disbanded after it was defeated by the Marines and Roger Pirates. Big Mom considered a threat even when she was a mere kid. Kaido. Kaido is the captain of the Beast Pirates. He is currently one of the Yonku. Kaido possesses a mythical zone devil fruit that allows him to turn into a mythical dragon. He is considered the strongest creature in the world, Kaido can't be killed with any method. The only thing that has ever hurt him is Enma and the last person to do so was Kazuki Odin, who ended up as Odin Soup. Like Big Mom, he too was a part of the Rocks Pirates. His skill at that time is currently unknown. Kazuki Odin. He was respected by everyone in the country. Odin was a very benevolent person and it earned him love and respect of everyone in Wano. Odin had sailed with Whitebeard in the past. He was one of their divisional commanders. Odin left the crew and joined Roger Pirates. He was a very powerful swordsman. Odin possessed two swords, Aim no Habakiri and Enma. With his swordsmanship, Odin was able to damage Kaido when they fought. He also managed to beat Ashura Doji who is capable of fighting against one of Kaido's three commanders. Silver's Rayleigh. Silver's Rayleigh used to be the first mate of the Pirate King, Gold D. Roger. Rayleigh is among the few characters who can use all three types of hockey. He can also use advanced armament hockey and observation hockey. Rayleigh has the epithet of Dark King, back when Kaido and the others were young, Rayleigh should have been stronger than them. Even his old age, Rayleigh's strength is comparable to that of an admiral. If we talk about the current times, Rayleigh would not stand a chance against Kaido and Big Mom. Sengoku. Sengoku is the former fleet admiral of the Marines. He is one of the most well-known characters in the series. Sengoku possesses Hito Hito Nomi, model, Debutsu. He turns into a giant golden Buddha in this form. Sengoku can launch shockwaves in this form. During the old era, Sengoku was one of the admirals. Even in his old age, Sengoku was able to beat Blackbeard and his crew without much difficulty. His power during the old era is relatively unknown, but there is no doubt that he would have managed to fight against the strongest of enemies. Shaki. Golden Lion, Shaki is one of the most infamous pirates in the history of One Piece. He is also known as the Flying Pirate, Shaki ate the Fua Fua Nomi that allows him to float anything inorganic in himself. Shiki's ability does not work on living things. He was one of the rivals of Gold D. Roger and he actually fought against Roger during the Ed War. Despite this Shiki had a lot of respect for Roger. He refused to believe that the Navy could have caught Roger. Shiki destroyed half of Marineford on his own and it took Garp and Sengoku's combined efforts to put a stop to his rampage. Shiki was imprisoned in Impel Down, but he escaped from the facility. Monkey D. Garp. Monkey D. Garp is the strongest marine that we have seen so far in the series. Garp is also known as, Hero of the Marines. This title was given to him after the God Valley incident. Garp is one of the few characters who has no Devil Fruit ability, however, he had extremely strong hockey. With his hockey, Garp was able to flatten Don Chinjiao's head, which was able to split an ice continent into two. Garp rejected the opportunity of becoming an admiral because he didn't want to be the direct control of the world nobles. 
Edward Newgate. Edward Newgate, also known as Whitebeard, is a former Yonku. Whitebeard held the title of the strongest man alive while he was alive. Whitebeard held the title well before Roger started to dominate the seas. Whitebeard possesses the Gura Gura Nomi. The power of devil fruit is considered to be so great that it could destroy the entire world. Whitebeard was also a member of Rock's Pirates and he was present during the God Valley incident. It is unknown how powerful was that at that time but, it should be kept in mind that he was the strongest man in the world, even before Roger became the Pirate King. Gold D. Roger. Roger is arguably the strongest character in One Piece to date. He was the first person who was able to conquer the Grand Line with his crew. Roger learned the secrets of the Void Century, and that made him a huge threat to the world government. There is no information on whether he possesses a devil fruit or not. Roger was well respected by his opponents such as Shaki, Whitebeard, and Monkey D. Garp. Roger fought against the Rocks Pirates at God Valley. He joined forces with the Marines and put an end to the reign of Rocks D. Zebek. Rocks D. Zebek. The final character on the list is Rocks D. Zebek. Rocks D. Zebek was the leader of Rocks Pirates. In the old era, Zebek was considered the biggest threat to the world government. He wanted to become the ruler of the world. It is unknown what kind of powers Zebek had. Zebek is considered to the most formidable rival of Gold D. Roger. The era of rocks was brought to an end by the combined efforts of Roger Pirates and the Marines.